When does health research need ethics review? People's well-being and improvements in health depend to a large extent on research, which enables the development of new technologies, vaccines, and cures. The COVID-19 pandemic has highlighted the ethical duty to conduct research to understand this disease, as well as to find safe and efficacious interventions to prevent, diagnose, and treat it and to formulate strategies to curb the pandemic. We call research any biomedical, behavioral, epidemiological, or social science activity that systematically collects and analyzes data with the intent of producing generalizable knowledge. We say that research is with people when people are exposed to observation, intervention, or other interaction with the researchers directly or by modifying their environment and also when participants can be individually identified when collecting or using their biological samples, medical data, or other records. All research with people must be reviewed before its start by a research ethics committee to ensure it gets conducted ethically and that participants are protected. Research does not require ethics review if it does not involve people. For example, if it uses public data that does not identify them. Public health activities that are not research, such as surveillance, don't need ethics review either. Unlike research, these activities aim at preventing or controlling diseases for the direct benefit of the population. Sometimes it can be difficult to distinguish whether an activity is research or not. If there can be any doubt, the ethics committee is the one to decide. We all benefit from research involving people. Let's make sure that participants are treated ethically and protected always.